Ito na, wala nang atrasa to. Ang uh, matatalo po sa gabing ito ay pwede na pong magpahinga. Pwede na pag-isipan ang susunod na conference. Pag And this knockout game is underway. Uh, Air 21, of course, sila ang uh, naka-purple uniforms. Ang uh, Hinebra naman, naka-immaculate white. And Homer says the basketball. First shot of the game, air ball. Arwin Santos, no go. After Rivas with the rebound. Just going over the starters here, the primary protagonists uh, para sa Hinebra. It's Tupid and Helterbrand in the backcourt. Uh, Kagiwa will act in a small forward spot. Asama si Rafi Rivas at si Eric Beck. Traditional Hinebra three guard uh, combo. But you, I would think this lineup the uh, Barangay Hinebra has on the floor is their strongest five that they have in their uh, entire arsenal. Although oftentimes, I get to see Sunday Salvation on uh, small forwards, uh, the starting unit. Turn over Laban sa Hinebra. Air 21 begins with Jack Chia and the cup batting Gary David in the backcourt. Asama si Homer Se, Ranadel De Ocampo, and the ever so consistent Arwin Santos. And of course, you all know Homer say he believes in giving the fouls, not keeping them for himself. Parang na araw-araw Pasko sa kanya. Always in the spirit of giving. Aan hit mo ang fouls for the next game. Di mo rin ng mauwi. Di mo rin mababaw. Here's Eric Meck over to Helter Brad against Chia. Helter Brad fires. Remember, Jack Chia used to play for Hinebra. Gia now the quarterback of the starting unit. We have five points. Opening quarter. Gia fires and misses. Kagiwa with a long rebound. Just got it, David. Bounce pass. Homer said no go. Arwin Santos with a putback. That's actually the first good shot that Air 21 has taken. You look at most of the shots that they've taken. The mga tira nilang three pointers off balance. That's one of the things that gets them in trouble in terms of their field goal percentage. Two to nothing ball game here inside the Cuneta Astrodome. Here's Vivis in a boot. Kagiwa, Kagiwa bangs into a brick wall. Here's Tubi. He fires and scores. Team oh, Andres for Ronald Tubi. Ronald Tubi starting in the lineup. Usually he's the energy guy that comes off the bench. Ngayon na may Paul Artadi na sila. They can afford for Ronald Tubi to start. As Deo Campo scores against uh, national teammate Eric Beck. Balik ang lamang sa Air 21 with 10 minutes to go in the opening quarter. Here's Helter Brown. Team 3. Nebra, the only thing that they're throwing up so far are three-point attempts. Wala pa silang attempt mula sa two-point region. Express down by two. Jack Chia. Hosting up Helter Brown and he scores! Very offensive-minded to start the ball game, Jack Chia. You remember uh, one of the first plays of the game, he a three-pointer. Clay naman kinostehan niya to si JJ Helterbrand. He probably told his coach something up during the times that he was still practicing with Barangay Ginebra. Alamang sinabi niya kay Coach Bo, alam mo, nung nagpa-practice ako, sabi ko yan, oo, pinopostehan ko lang yan. Ang tanong eh, naniwala siguro si Coach Bo eh. I would say it's a pabili sa siguro ay without a doubt Helter Brand would leave Chia behind pero marahil sa palakasan ng katawan ay mahanga ang lamang itong si Jack Chia We're tied at 6 in the opening quarter of this knockout game Here's Helter Brand Pinasa kay Tubid Tubid fires at lahat ng puntos ng Ginebra kaling TM Country TM3 na naman for Tubid and you know, those three-pointers, they're uh, easy three-pointers because they are in uh, rhythm at walang uh, nagko-contest. So, magandang naman kagad si Arwin uh, Santos. He has uh, four, uh, four points in the ballgame. Cutting down in Ebra's lead to one. And Miko, he already has three offensive rebounds in the si Arwin Santos. Not that time, para kay Tupi. Here's Kagiwa. Bagong shot lock para sa Ginebra. Up by one point. Here's Rivas. In a boat, Kagiwa pull up. It is good. Scorching outside shooting here for Hinebra. For Mark Kagiwa, that's a good sign. We know that he's missed some time in the last game. Kaya sinubukan niya lang maglaro against Talking Tex. 
really critical for him to get going early in this game. First personal laban kay uh, Big. Second team foul laban sa Hinebra. Eight and a half to go. The opening quarter. Here's David. Good move against Marco Liwa. The start of this game, uh, offense has been uh, at a high level, or you might say the defense has been struggling to contain the offense of the other side. Here's Helter Brand. Inside, Kubin. That shot is blocked by Arwin Santos. Here's Homer Se. He's going to take it all the way. Pull it up, pull it in David. Got it a bit sidestep. Beauty! Four points for Mr. Pure Energy. And the ball there, 21. One point, 12 11, with over seven minutes to go. In the opening quarter, Billy Stock Pali to the Puntis Dito. We already have uh, on the board 25 points between the two teams, and uh, we've only gotten through a bit over four minutes. This is, of course, Air 21's style of play. Yes, it usually is their style of play, but this year, from what I recall, has been the first year in a long, long time. Ninety sila nag average ng over a hundred points. So this is uh, basically the identity of the night. The block, I think it was Radadel de Ocampo who blocked that shot. Ito, Karen David. Radadel, open shot! Yes, sir! Team 3 for Radadel de Ocampo. Back inside the Cuneta Astrodome. At sa punong ito punta natin, si Paolo Trillo. Yes, Miko. Para kay Coach Jerm Uichiko. Itong conference ito has been a conference of adjustments para sa Barangay Hinebra. Ang sabi niya, they really struggled early dahil sa mga injuries. Pero ngayon, healthy-healthy na sila. So they're looking to really make it through the wild card phase. Ang sabi daw niya, uh, it's key na huwag daw sila makikipagsabayan dito sa Air 21. Uh, para naman dito kay Coach Bo Perasol. Ang sabi niya, eh, lahat ng kaya niyang ibatao. Dito papunta, uh, papunta sa Barangay Hinebra in this ball game, ibabato daw ng Air 21. Ang sabi niya naman, key factor sa kanila is that they really have to control the guards of Barangay Hinebra para hindi raw ma-excite masyado ang, mga, ang fans, ang mga crowd ng Barangay Hinebra dito sa Cuneta Astro. Guys, bakit nila ay bato eh? Pwede rin padala through Air 21. <laughs> Sagot nga nila ang padala mo. But, uh, you know, Hinebra... Uh, do not let their uh, win-loss record uh, fool you. I mean, it's misleading because they, they, they play with so many games without Mark Kagiwa. Without Mark Kagiwa, without Eric Meg, and Eric without Meg, yeah. Rafi Rivest. Correct. You remember that at the start of the year, all three guys were absent in that lineup. And uh, ang nipis nun lineup nila nung panahon na yon. But yet, they were still able to steal some victories. Speaking of stealing, <laughs> you snatcher. <laughs> Well, Arboleda, Arboleda and Kramer have checked in the ball game para palitan si Homer C. Homer C. and uh, Jack Chia. And uh, you feel that uh, Winnie is going to play a vital role tonight. But I think for Winnie, uh, napaka importante. You know, he's a veteran of this team. Yeah, one time I was talking to him, natatawa nga siya dahil sabi niya, ako na yung pinaka-veteran <laughs> dito. And, uh, you know, looking at the stats, he's the best guy in terms of assists for his team. And uh, early on, miskilabang sila. Isa pa lang yung assist ng team na to. And that's what Winnie Arboleda brings to this team. When he's on the floor, mas maganda yung igot ng bola. I'm sure when you were dribbling the basketball when you were playing, you'd rather have Arboleda as your teammate than Arboleda guarding you. Well, obviously, and, uh, ito si Winnie kasi ang problema. He may not be the biggest, but he's so strong na pag nabangga ka, matitinag ka, especially when you're dribbling. Hindi naman natin ang good si Helter Brand. Another TM3 para dito sa Hinebra. They are scorching here in the opening quarter. They're shooting, over, shooting at 60%. We talked about how bad they've shot this conference. Pero lahat yan, pila na bubura dahil sa shooting lang yung araw na to. I think both teams are gunning for 200 <laughs> points. Uh, halos uh, limang minuto pa natitira dito. But uh, already, uh, that's been a high scoring affair. Walang patid ang palito ng puntos between the two squads. Alam, malamang pagkatapos ng first quarter, susukatin yung ring kung exacto ba talaga yung size nito dahil lahat sila eh, both teams are uh, seemingly not missing at all. Although in that report with Paolo, he, he mentioned that Coach Joe, which is very conscious of the fact na huwag makipagsabayan dito sa Air 21. Well, that's why he had to call that early timeout. Although they were just down by four, he was noticing 
that the tempo was already moving towards the tempo of Air 21. At yun nga yung uh, talagang iniiwasan niya. Amaril uh, misses that uh, jumper. We're tied at 21 as we approach the last four minutes of the opening quarter. By the way, Mamaril came in para kay Eric Mix. Meantime, here's Ranadel de Ocampo. Tapikan ng bola. It will go out. It will, it will go to Hinebra. Spacing that time around. Problem of Air 21. Too many guys on one side. Kaya miski umatake si Ranidel. Eh, masyado na masikip yung uh, at naging mahirap yung kanyang tira. Half pass. Hindi nang kaitibiyan dun si uh, Mamaril at Helterbrand. A little uncharacteristic. Hinebra already has four turnovers on the other side. Ito namang Air 21. Eh, hindi pa tinatapon yung bola. Here's Deo Campo. Oh, he's fouled. Clipped on the arc. Bakala, pumasok ang pangalawang free throw for Ranadel Deo Campo. Tatlong free throws ang binigay sa kanya. He made the first two. And he made all three. At lamang po ng tatlo ang Air 21. 24, 21. Here's Kagiwa. Salvacion is now in the ball game para sa Hinebra. Here's Sunday Salvacion. Salvacion over to Helter Brand. Nine on the shot clock. Helter Brand has the ball. Helter Brand goes to Rivas. Rivas pull it back. Salvacion 4-3. Yes, sir! TM3 for Sunday Salvacion. And I'm sure Coach John Wichigo would be very happy with that play. Ang ganda ng ball movement nila. They really ran their plays. Air 21 tried to hold on to the deep, to their defense as long as they could. Pero, pero itong Hinebra, eh, talagang they really stuck to their system. Everyone is getting uh, easy attempts. Eh, titignan natin, 3-point field goal shooting nila. 5 out of 7 because there's so many things going on at, in the middle of the basket, down at the block. Yung depensa ng Air 21 has to be aware of all the things that are going on. Under three minutes remaining, dito sa quarter number one, here's Big Mama. Uh, Robert Ting Jr. Nahuli ito si Canaleta. Nihila yung report ni Salvacion. Nebra down by one point. Giwa has nowhere to go. Fourth to shoot para sa Hinebra. Pitira na dito si Ao. Mamari wasn't aware of it. Yeah, it's been a thrill to watch because you can look at Air 21. They're not regarded as one of the better defensive teams. Pero maganda yung pinapakita nila. Kramer with a putback off an offensive rebound. They're talking about offensive rebounds to Air 21. Killing Baranga Hinebra off the boards. Anim na offensive rebounds na sila. On the flip side, Hinebra iisa pa lamang. Approaching the last two minutes of the opening quarter. Here's Mamaril. Turns around and scores. And chalk up another assist for Baranga Hinebra. Yung assist department naman, doon naman sila lumalabang na malaki. Yung assist-wise, Miko, itong uh, Hinebra already have 8 assists. Itong Air 21, 8 top 3 assists na. Duty foul on the part of Mamaril uh, dahil pateko na itong si uh, Rocket. JC in A lot of people are still waiting for that... Uh, Isang dunk ni JC sa PBA na talagang uh, that will get you off your ear. I think he's uh, getting his bearings here. Oh, look at, uh, baka magulat kayo ha. Vic Pablo is, uh, has now checked in the ball game. Yes, he is playing now for Hinebra. A trip down memory lane oh. para kay Vic Pablo. He did, he is now back with his, uh, yung, teammate niya na matagal sa FEU magkasama na ulit Vic 
Pablo and Johnny Abarientos. And of course, he also played with uh, Ginebra for a while. That's why, you know, Richard De Los Aris has to entertain in foolish thoughts <laughs> of making his own comeback. Meantime, Eric Meg scores inside. Richard, Richard was part of the fabled Eco Ismael rivalry. <laughs> Kahit nga tatay mo. Ayun na nga eh. Pinanood nga ng tatay mo yan. Magaling daw. Magaling daw mag-commentate. Here's Arwin Santos. Santos. Oh! There's an awkward shot. Nagawa ng bola. Nadula si Pablo. Of course, Vic Pablo, unlike his Former team is still playing. Is still former team yun na tanggal na kanina. Pinalo na po. Kung kakauwi nyo lang or kabubukas nyo lang na inyong TV sets, pinalo po ni Asi Taolaman at Coca-Cola Tigers at Pocket Text Phone Pals for the second consecutive game, thereby ousting the Phone Pals from the race. And now the Tigers are waiting. With bated breath, uh, who will win this game? Tell you, nakakalabari nila sa linggo for another knockout showdown. Players of uh, Talk and Text must be having nightmares of uh, doon sa mga mukha ng mga player ng Coca-Cola dahil una, eh, tinalo sila nung Wednesday so they, that's why they had to go straight to the wild card and not have a uh, playoff for the uh, quarterfinals. Tapos ngayon, naglaban sila ulit. Ganun na naman ang ginawa sa kanila. Asi must be really happy though. I'm very sure he is. <laughs> if that's not poetic justice for him, I don't know what is. But one of the things that we uh, natin, four turnovers and run, that's the express. They've, commit, they've made Hinebra commit six and they've scored ten points out of those on the other side. Hinebra, wala pang pino force na turnovers sa Air 21. At syempre, wala pa sila nakukuwang puntos mula dito. We're tied at 31. Time winding down here in the opening quarter. Elter Brando go. And Arboleda has the basketball. Another 30 seconds to play. That's a perfect bounce pass. And a perfect slam dunk from KG Canaleta. Yeah, what a thrill when Air 21 is running, especially when you have Winnie running the point. And when you see it, KG Canaleta on one side, JC Intal on the other. Usually you get a treat like that. About the two Air 21. Six seconds remaining in the opening quarter. Helter Brand has the ball. Helter Brand over to Meg. Meg will score! Right after that, nakita natin yung uh, tira ni Eric Meg. Nangyari doon. So close to the basket. And uh, you have to push a guy like him off the block or else he's going to get easy points. Well, from the field, I don't think uh, you can do any better than what they're shooting so far. 68%. And that's coming out of nine assists. Here's Arboleda. Yes, sir! Team 3 for Winnie Arboleda. Both teams actually uh, quite hot uh, from uh, Rainbow Country. Paul Artadi is in the game for the first time. Para sa Ginebra, joining Salvacion, Nick, Vic Pablo, and Ronald Tubi. And Second personal laban kay Canaleta. First team foul para sa Air 21 and marvelous Marvin Cruz. Has entered the ball game. What to expect? A fierce showdown here between Artadi and Marvin Cruz. Meantime, here's Tubin. 4 3, no go. Pablo with an offensive rebound and the snatcher is going to be called for a foul. First personal laban kay Arboleda. First team foul. Now check that. Second team foul. Laban to Air 21. Hebra down by two. In the early moments of the second quarter. Here's Mick. Twirls. Fires. No go. Going to be last touch on Salvation. Uh, we have to look, uh, Miko, kung ba ito mga kapunan na to can continue the pace of scoring that we had in the first quarter. 36-34 out here. You would think that eventually, it will be the two teams to. Nice two-man game between Ranadel de Ocampo and Winnie Arboleda. Basic basketball, ginawa ni Winnie tsaka ni Ranadel. Pass it at the post. Once you pass, you cut. And you have to be ready to get the pass back. 
Here's Tubin, swings it over to Salvasor against Santos. Tubin, 4-3. Victorino took see Ronald Tubin after waxing hot in the opening quarter. Rebound si Artadi. Tubira si Arboleda. Rebound for Bing. Here's Tubin on the move. Steps on the brakes with 15 on the shot clock. Bring it again, Beck. Beck, 4-3. Beck gets his own miss. Pinasa kay Pablo. Pablo goes back to Beck. Lots of time on the shot clock para sa Hinebra. Out by four points. Here's Arpadi. And he gets the layup. See, Marvin Cruz at Tinawagan ng foul is uh, first personal. Bonus free throw for Paul Artadi. Ayan na kompleto ang three-point play. Kaya uh, dalawa pa rin ang abate ng Air 21. 38-36. Here's Phil Capo. Fires. Si Artadi na ang pulit ng rebound. Artadi on the move. Artadi is still going over to Kagiwa. Kagiwa fires. Yes, sir. And the tempo just increases the moment na hawakan ni Paul Artadi yung bola. Miski yung mga teammates na hindi rin alam kung anong gagawin niya. Just because he's so quick. Arboleda with a TM3 at may pabaong pang uh, sulyap uh, dito sa bench ng Hinebra. Back to the three-point lead for Air 21. 41-38. And uh, it's brisk in the second quarter. Ever since Pumasok si Winnie Arboleda, he's just been on fire. Tatlong three-pointers already with 13 points in this game. Si Gabi Espinas pumasok po para sa Air 21. Here's Kagiwa, handoff, Salvacion, he fakes and fires. Misses. The snatcher gets the basketball from Rivas. Arboleda over to Espinas and he will miss. Leo Capo will score on the follow-up. Loser. Pwede na pagandaan yung uh, susunod na conference. 8 and 28 remaining dito sa second quarter. Salvacion sends it over to Kagiwa with 5 to shoot. 4 to shoot para sa Hinebra. Rivas does not know it. And Elter Brand fires in the air ball. Because that's the second time na nangyari yan para dito sa Barangay Hinebra. So you would think Air 21 is doing a decent job of forcing them to make that extra pass. And sometimes, nakakalimutan na tuloy ng Barangay Hinebra yung shot clock nila. Yan, lamang pa rin ang lima, ang Air 21 Express. Yekchea back in the court, replacing Arboleda is Santos. Santos, 4-3. Agiwa with the rebound. Here's Helterbrand. Kagiwa on the move. Pinasa kay Salvacion. Fouls a plenty para dito sa Air 21 sa quarter na to. They are already in the penalty after that foul. On the flip side, Miko, Barangay Hinebra, ni isang foul. Wala pang uh, natatawag sa kanila sa quarter na ito. Here's after breath. Spin. Pinasa kay Mamaril. Off the glass. The ball game. Still a three-point lead para sa Air 21 but they throw the ball away. Ito, Kagiwa. Kagiwa on the move. Kagiwa sidestepping. Kagiwa fires and scores! 81-73. And Mingo, what a turnaround for that Coke team. Remember, at the mid in the middle of this conference, eh, halos eh, everyone already uh, said na wala nang pag-asa tong Coca-Cola. But one move, just one move, really turned the fortunes of that team around. move of getting a 6-9 that uh, for the first three games averaged about 20 points and about 16 rebounds. <laughs> Score that at 43-42 in favor of the Air 21. And Kagiwa goes for the lead. Ah! Rebound para kay Arboleda. Pambilis ng pinarig dito si Arboleda. Speed na sa kay Radadel. Hand off. Gabby Espinas! 
It's a, just a nice fast break for the Air 21. Unselfish that time around. One of the problems that they've had in the conference at all. Sometimes they take the shot too early and they take four shots that time around. Hindi gano nang nangyari. Here's Arwin Santos. Santos on the ball. And he is fouled. You know, the, the athleticism of Air 21 is just astonishing. And from two from their uh, two position all the way to their center. Eh, kaya nilang uh, tumakbo. Tapos yung guardia naman nila, pwedeng pang-post up. <laughs> and I think that's usually what they get. Especially when draft day comes around, inahanap talaga nila yung best athletes available in the draft. Yes, sir! He had dress for the stature. Well, he never has to find a way to get him out of that spot. Halos lahat ng three-pointers niya, dun nang gagaling. Tied into the second quarter. Here's Tubid. Tubid inside. Tubid in trouble. And, uh, see, that turnover was caused by Arboleda. You know, he can not only post up, he can hold up. That's his nature. Boy, he really, really wreaks havoc though. A lot of ball handlers did the PBA. I think if you had a survey, you see, the guards are not so hard to you know, opposing point, point guards. guards yeah. I think yeah. Winnie would be the guy. The stats are must match victory. Winnie Arboleda, since he came in, 16 points, only one miss from a three point range. The tag mo pa siya, meron na siyang apat na rebound at dalawang assist. You know him very well. Well, good for me. You know, most of the time that I spent with Winnie, we were teammates. Oh, kaya miss kina sa snatcha na ko. Ingi ko rin pagkatapos. Oh, it's ayo lang. It's ayo lang yun. There's Arboleda outside the Ocampo. 4-3. Tinulak ni Espina si Rafi Rivas. This is the problem when you get into uh, penalty quite early. Loose ball fouls just like that one. Eh, dinadala mo na kagad yung uh, kalaban mo to the free throw line. Really, la pag uh, napepenalty ka, Miko, parang yung pagiging agresibo mo, mabilis nawawala. Dahil uh, nadadala ka. Matatakot ka. Matatakot ka, oh. Eric Beck, uh, binalik sa ating laro para palitan si Billy Mamaril. Second free throw for long, tall, Rafi Rivas. Nagahabol pa rin ang Ginebra dito as we approach the last five minutes of the first half. Here's Arboleda. Almost but not quite. Rivas to Kagiwa. He goes behind the back, and he is cut through. Ado lamang pa rin ang Air 21 dito. Arboleda! At that time. And the snatcher! He is all over the place. Parang maloy yata kape dito eh. Tubid was complaining about that last play. Sinasabi niya na pinangga siya ni Arboleda. Still asking the referees for that call. Second person to lap against the Ocampo. Kanina pa nakadas a penalty itong Air 21. Pina sits down and Homer Singh is back on the court. Two misses, a uh, couple of free throws. He's been here in Barangay Hinebra. Also, Rafi Rivas a while ago also split his charities. And si Eric Meg naman, dalawa ang minintis. Leo Capo. And uh, I believe the culprit is rather than Leo Capo. And again, he never walks down the opposite side of the court. The 
get free throws. Malas lang yung Ginebra, hindi po apasok yung mga free throws nila. They've already missed 5 out of their 11 attempts. Just a shade over 50% yung uh, tinitira nila. Ginebra yeah, failing to maximize the early penalty situation here at Air 21. One out of two para kay uh, Bick. Still a two-point lead for the Express, 48-46. Four minutes of meeting here in the first half of play. Arboleda for three. Yes! <laughs> the impress for Arboleda. What a second quarter for Willie Arboleda. Scoring four three-pointers in this quarter alone. A better na siyang 19 points. That's an emphatic shot block by Arwin Santos. Here's Arboleda. Cadaleta. That's going to be a foul against Tubit. And Tubit seems a little frustrated, frustrated. Ever since you nabangga siya ni Winnie Arboleda, he has to get his head back into the ball game. That's important. Si Rayo pa, eh. na si Ray Laru niya. Naunahan siya ni Arboleda eh. Last touch on Rivas, 13 to shoot para sa Air 21. Man of the moment is Willie Arboleda. So we talked about him, him being the veteran at uh, dapat uh, ang mga veterano, sila ang magdala doon sa kapunan nila, especially during knockout ball games. And he has really stepped up to the plate and done an excellent job so far. Tubit, having trouble with the ball, binigay muna kay Helter Brand. Helter Brad hand off, and there's a foul, and Rivas will take two. See, Arwin Santos at Tinawagan of foul, the second personal. But again, yung mga free throw, uh, Miko, nagiging problema. Nang Barangay Hinebra in the first quarter, Air 21 was play, able to play defense without fouling. Here in the second opposite, they've been committing fouls, but Barangay Hinebra has been unable to take uh, advantage of those those uh, attempts from the free throw line. Now, Winnie Arboleda from the three point uh, line. Talo talo yung buong Barangay Hinebra. Dahil Barangay Hinebra hindi pa na shoot pula sa three point region after doing so hard in the first quarter. Ay, baka po na tayo sa Dokonete Asu Dome for more Bakbak at Viernes action. Iko Halili kasama si Jason Webb. And here's Tubid to Kagiwa. Kagiwa on the ball. He fires and misses. Feeding gently. 10 seconds to shoot uh, para sa Air 21. Jet Gia, 3, yes sir! 21, it seems lahat ng tira naman nila sa 3, yun ang pumapasok. Pasok pa ba yung uh, turnaround ni Ronald Tuber. He has 8 points in the ball game. Pero labang pa rin ang 5. Ang um, X-Press, 54-49. 2 minutes to go in the first half. And here's Homer Se. And Homer C. Uh, just lost real estate. <laughs> Nalan grabbing siya doon. <laughs> Meantime, here's Meng. Inabot kay Helter Brad. He goes baseline and scores! <laughs> Helter Brad now in double figures with 10 points. Still a 3 point lead for Air 21. 54 51. Close to a minute remaining, Dito's uh, second quarter. Here's Jack Chi on the move, and he will miss. Tip in is no good. One more tip in, wala pa rin. And Homer, the destroyer, almost destroyed someone. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's a technical foul. And, and Homer say is living. Yeah, that might be more of a case of uh, reputation more than anything. Let's just take a look at that replay. That'll, uh,
try to restrain Homer C because uh, I think he's about to shred the referee's <laughs> uniforms to pieces. And, uh, Homer C has come. Technical free throw. Homer C scoreless dito sa ating laro. <laughs> In their, in their last game, uh, Homer said actually had a good scoring ball game. I believe it was against uh, Santa Lucia. Amigo, may pagong paborito na ang barangay. Dahil matagal-tagal nila di makikita si Adukul. That's a semi-final snap, Bill Foods. Out of two. By the way, you personal foul kanina against Helter Brand, right? which was called before the technical foul against Homer Sin. Score down at 55-52. Three-point lead for the Express. Alley up for Mark Tadiwa. Here's Canaleta for three. Yes, sir! The Express for KG Canaleta. It's just raining threes para dito sa Air 21. Total of six three-pointers in this second quarter. They only have two field goals, and the rest are all three-point baskets. Kaya apat ang inahabol dito ng Inebra. Only 30 seconds remaining bago matapos ang first half. Helter Brand for three. Rebound para kay Eric Beck. Now a drop pass para kay Rivas. Good job of Rafi Rivas to make himself available. Hindi ka agad siya bumaba pagkatapos ng rebound. And on the other hand, yung bumabantay sa kanya. Out of the picture, trying to run the fast break. 10 seconds to shoot for Air 21. Jack Chia with the pull up. Bola, nahuwan ni Kagiwa. 3 seconds to go. Kagiwa sidestepping, fires, and almost scores, but not quite. The winner of this game. We will meet Coca-Cola in a knockout game on Sunday. And then the winner of the knockout game on Sunday will proceed to the quarterfinals to face last year. Meantime, here's Beck. It's a violation against uh, Eric Beck. Yung uh, Pure Foods at Santa Lucia, sila po ay uh, naghihintay. Waiting in the semi-final round. And of course, Santa Lucia, the hottest property right now in the PBA. They are so far the biggest story. Because nobody expected them to be sitting pretty in the semi-finals right now. Yes, uh, in terms of uh, you know the good side, you know, probably the biggest story. I guess the next biggest story is uh, how uh, Token Tex also got an early exit in the Liga Nantes, regarded as one of the top two teams to start the league. And you know, if Magnolia is not careful, uh, well, they might join Token Tex in, uh, in the uh, undesirable vacation. Oh, pero ito muna, Miko. Isa dito sa dalawa na to ang magiging kasama ng Token Tex at ng Wellcoat. Of course, Wellcoat was the first team to take a vacation. Yes, Alfred Brad will go. It's foul spotted by Mar Montiel. By the way, speaking of Wellcoat, the anak ni Coach Leo Austria, si Raymond, back on Austria, is uh, actually watching along with uh, Jai Reyes, uh, Claire, Claudine, and, uh, the other friends. Uh, Team time here is uh, Kramer. Nasakay Ranadel de Ocampo for three. Yes, sir! TF3 for Ranadel de Ocampo. Oh, saw the shots this quarter. Nanggaling mula kay Ranadel de Ocampo. But he's finally found his mark from three point range. He's missed a couple of gimmies in terms of uh, sa kanya. Dahil usually mga bank shots niya has not fallen sa aro na to. Stopped the man with his own team, Tracy J.J. Helterbrand, and that will cut down Air 21's lead to 2. 61-59. Here's Kramer. Arboleda. Fires. 
Ben scores! <laughs> Winnie Arboleda is red hot with 22 points and six three-point shots. And I talked about how Winnie Arboleda is key, but if you told me that he was going to come here and have six three-point shots, I probably would not have believed you. But Ginebra is finding it hard to believe. Kubit. Yes, sir. The Empress. We're going to start the opening quarter. We're going to fall in love with that three-point shot. But why not? Because both of them are shooting over 40% wala the three-point area. There's Arboleda. One more try. Ah! Almost, but not quite. Got it in. It's blocked. Eric makes it down. Big Mama, Billy Mamaril, is back in the ball game. You know, Arboleda has 22, and then Ranadel has 19. That's why you know Air 21 has absolutely no problem putting up points. That's right. Here's Rivas. Good foul on the part of Jack Chia. Make him earn it from the free throw line. Should have been a dunk kung itong uh, si Rafi Rivas pinabayaan niya. Those are you know, fouls that you have to give up. You have these six fouls and you have to use it wisely and that was a wise foul. Well, ito si Rivis, kanina pa nahihirapan no? from the free throw line as Canaleta checks back in the ball game. Para palitan si uh, Doug Kramer. Turns out to be a wise fight. Para kay uh, Jack Chia. Ito mga free throw na ito na namimintis ng Barangay Hinebra. It has been a close ball game. Malamang habulin nila ito pagdating ng end game. And if you're guarding Ranidel de Ocampo, you have to be as patient as he is. Hindi siya nagmamadali pag nandun siya sa poste, so you have to keep your feet on the ground. 21 points for de Ocampo. Here's Tubin. Drop pass. Another pass. That's going to, get, that's going to go against Ranidel de Ocampo. Pang-apat na yan. Pero ganda ng pasahan na pinapakita ng uh, Barangay Hinebra. Really making Air 21 work on defense. Shots for Billy Moreno. It gives you the urban song for Ranadel Ocampo. It's a great 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 song for Ranadel Ocampo. Canaleta, Arboleda, Santos, Irving Soto, and Jack Chia. Eyes on. America's premium leisure wear, known for its technology inspired theme designs and colorful product line. Visit an Eyes on store now. Chia offensive rebound, Bagong shot lock. Arboleda thought about it. Nice pass for Arwin Santos, but he missed. Ito si Tubid, over to Kagiwa. Kagiwa, oh, blocked by Canaleta! Here's Elton Brown, first three! Gabulang uh, Inebra Dito still down by two. Elton Brad telling the troops, let's go. Air 21 holding on to that two point lead, 68 66. Alas, nakakalahan din sa third quarter. And Arwin Santos will miss. Bola na ko ni Canaleta. Arboleda fires. Yes, sir! <laughs> Rene Arboleda is the man of the moment. 25 points at uh, yun ang kanyang pangpitong. Three-point shot. 
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Pico, kung ano naman ang gawin ni Winnie Arboleda, sinasagot naman ang Barangay Ginebra as a team. And you know, the people from TM, they're very, very happy tonight. <laughs> It's Jack Chia for three. No go. Ginebra still down by two. 71-69 at the halfway mark of this exciting third period. Here's Kagiwa. Elter Brand. Salvasur. Can't shoot. Here's Kagiwa. Two to shoot. Kagiwa fires. No go. Lipad. See Willie Arboleda who is doing everything in his power to uh, keep Air 21 in the race for the Philippine Cup. Ibigyan natin sa Buwaga. Kasama na si Elong Natividad. At si Toy Toy Palcasantos. <laughs> Of course, Noy Noy Falcasantos played many years in the PBA, was with Santa Lucia. Kaibigan natin yan, Noy Noy. Kamusta? And Ginebra also. He also played for Ginebra. Meantime, JC in town scores on Salva Show. 4-3. Yes, sir! Sunday special. Eight points for Salva Show off the bench. TM Tresion for Salva Show. So, magkot naman kagad si Cataleta. You know, those three points by Sunday Salvation important para sa Barangay Ginebra because they're not really getting so much from the bench. You look at Air 21, ang daming po puntos mula sa bench and uh, for them, yan mga puto si Salvation. Importante sa kanila. He's the only guy from the bench that's in double. We talked about it all game long, 25 points. Gary David helping in that three-point uh, scoring column. Madami talaga mga tres. Ano lang sa signal dito? Another TF tres uh, that time from Gary David. Here's Kagiwa. Here's Helter Brown, the pull-up. Aubrey Cruz. That pass. Kramer was not even looking. Ito si Kagiwa. Kagiwa is foul. Third personal up at King Cataleta. Two shots for Kagiwa. Kagiwa trying to make up for lost time. Hindi nga ito nakasama ka agad. At the start of the conference with Kagiwa. Two point ball game here in the third quarter. Three and a half remaining in this uh, third period. Uh, JC Intal against Salvacion. Intal. No way to go. But the uh, foul is called against Sunday Salvacion. Aggressive. Uh, si, uh, JC Intal coming off that timeout. Obviously, a designed play for him. Yeah, aggressive, aggressive. But done off that timeout. Eric Beck and Ginebra picks up the basketball. They're down by three. Let's check out the leading scorers for Ginebra. JJ Helterbrand, Mark Caguio doing their share. We talked about the big three getting their points. It's up there. Tapos Sunday Salvacion from the bench. He is the one key guy that has contributed para sa bench ng Barangay Ginebra. Here's Ital. Ital has a green light to try and test the defense of Sunday Salvacion. And wouldn't it be perfect para kay JC kung ito pa naman yung maging uh, breakout game niya? 
everyone is watching. Jump bull po ito. Two bit against Ital. Both high flyers. Oles. Wait a minute. It should be Ital. Ito pareho lang mataas tumalun niya. Mga one inch lang diferensya. Okay. Here's David. Fires. Tough shot. Tough shot. Four shot. You know, you have to get the, you have a fresh shot clock. Get things going for your team. JC Intaz has been hot. Would have been wiser to go to him, but at least give him a touch. Uh, Marvin Cruz uh, picking up his third foul and uh, will send JJ Helterbrand to the line. Mark Mahapagal will uh, make his first appearance in this ball game to replace Mark Kagiwa. And the stature. Vinny Arboleda is back on the court. Air 21 survived the period. Kunsan, Vinny Arboleda They're able to maintain the lead. Now that Vinny is back, if he's still hot, problema na naman yan para dito sa Barangay Ginebra. Another wild shot coming from Ital. Two Move, too big. Trying to slice through. Ital gets the steal. Over to Arboleda. Arboleda, nakatingin kay Ital. Pero pinasa kay Arwin Santos. Fast. What a fast break. Almost all the guys of Air 21 on the fast break. A couple of guys from Ginebra trailing, unable to go down. Back to a four-point lead. For Air 21, with less than two minutes remaining. This is the third quarter. Arboleda almost getting the steal. Nine to shoot para sa Ginebra. Here's Tubid. Tubid on the move. Tubid, no. And Cataleta gets the basketball. Cataleta steps on the gas. Bounce pass Ital. He fires and misses. And Ital gets the loose ball. Pinasa kay Doug Kramer. Yes, sir. Four points for Kramer. Six-point lead para sa Air 21. Wala ng Hinebra, down by 6 points. Here's Salvasor. Nasa kay Ben, pero nakahawak si Kramer. Excellent design play coming off that timeout. Isolating Eric Menk against ito si Doug Kramer. First free throw is good for the former MVP. Now with a double double. 10 points, 10 rebounds. Apat ang labak dito ng Air 21. The force turnovers and run, napag usapan natin yan. And Nebra still a lot of turnovers and Air 21. Capitalizing on those turnovers. Stupid. Getting that rebound against three bigger men. Yeah, what? The mga fans dito tuwan tuwa. Baby face. And Homer the Destroyer is back on the court. Doug Kramer continues to plead this case with Ranadel de Ocampo, who cannot change the court. <laughs> well, at least Ranadel will listen. Right? He's got a shoulder to cry. A shoulder to cry. <laughs> Under a minute to go. This is the third quarter. Two-point lead for the Air 21. Gary David sends it over to Ital. Ital is productive here in the third quarter. Tal to Se, over Se, outside, JC Tal, try to go inside. Two seconds on the shot, lock out in the big, good score! A bailout para yun sa Air 21, because he never played excellent defense all the way to the 23rd second, pero nalibre pa rin si Gary David to make that shot. Gary David now with nine points in the ball game. 20 seconds remaining in the third period. Kapag inahabol ng Ginebra, Helderbrand has the ball with seven to shoot. They tried to go to Mink. 
third quarter. Arboleda fires and scores! Willie Arboleda played the game of his life with 27 points. And he's keeping here to advance to the quarterfinals. It will be a best of three. And uh, that team will be facing Alaska. So not an easy task. You, you know, you might say that if you lose here, you will continue to the semifinals. You might get the momentum. But remember, Alaska was number three in the league when uh, the eliminations ended. A lot of people are <laughs> texting me. <laughs> Asking me if it was true, na kung natatanggal nga yung talk and text. Well, it is true, including uh, si Aris Manalo is watching right now, a good friend of mine. Ayan, ito na ang ano, ang uh, patunay, patunay ay si Coach Binky Favis and the rest of the Tigers nanalo kanina. Walang kaduda-duda. Uh, 81-73, ousting the phone pass. Ibig sabihin po ay hanggang na po at talk and text at this conference. And Eric Mendel score the layup of three. Begin action here in the fourth and final quarter. That time around, it was Barangay Hinebra's turn to get on the fast break, have a four-on-one situation. Free throws continue to be a problem here para sa Hinebra. Actually, it's been the big men that have missed para sa Barangay Hinebra. No problem para kay Kagiwa, JJ Helterbrand, and Sunday Salvation. It's good. Rafi Rivas, Eric Meng, and Billy Bamarin. Here's Kagiwa on the goal. Kagiwa with a floater. Another by uh, Ital. And this ball is uh, picked up by Madrid. Sinagasan si Artadi. And it's a blocking foul against Artadi. And just when you thought the pace couldn't get any faster, Miko. <laughs> Itong dalawang team na to, we're in the fourth quarter. But yet, they're able to put it in another gear and even go faster than what we've been doing in the past three quarters. Well, it happens when you have Artadi and Marvin Cruz on the floor at the same time. Pinawag na, pinaghirapan. Eh, sarado na yung pintuan. Sinubukan tumahan sa bintana. Eh, sarado yung pintana. Pinagkasya pa rin sa sarili. Here's Makapagal. 4-3. No go. And it's a bit with a rebound. Six-point lead for the Express. David on the move. And he loses the ball. And it ends up with Salvador over to Makapagal. Makapagal. And look at the quick hands of Marvin Cruz. But uh, he never is saying that that's not last touch of Marvin Cruz. The quick hands of Marvin Cruz. That, if that was a layup, you would think this crowd would be up and cheering, not up in arms because they wanted the foul or a, uh, the ball possession. Here's Deo Campo, off the move. Back-to-back baskets for Ranidale Deo Campo. In the third quarter, this is Ranidale Deo Campo. Not the lead of the for the Air 21. Critical juncture here because the Earth 21 threatening to pull away. It's Kagiwa. Artadi. Kagiwa. 4 3. That's a big shot. A big game from Mark Kagiwa. Now, everything para kay Mark Kagiwa sa laro na to has been in rhythm. He's not forcing anything. And that's why you can see his shots. You know, they're, they're pretty clean coming in. Of course, the uproar is at Obigla. The foul on Pakapagal, by the way. Eight time here in Sin. Here's Radadel on the goal. And he gets swiped. Here's Artadi. Can he light it? And it's back for two. And we're back inside. I'm going to have to ask you to go up. And, uh, and then it's remaining in the ball game. And he has tres for Gary David. Back inside the Moneta Asudom. And he believes that the title retention bit dito ng uh, Hinebra. They are the defending champions of the Philippine Cup. But Jack Chia and the Express have been relentless in this ball game. You know, and every basket of Air 21 at this point is a step into uh, you know, pulling that crowd away. Pula dito sa Jin King. Here's Bing. Well, Inebra, they're trying. They're trying to stay in the game. 
the three and a half remaining here in the fourth and final quarter. Ang naging problema nila dito is uh, they have to pull out, pull down stops. Hindi e nila mapigil itong uh, Air 21 sa puto nito. That's a big stop for them. Here's Helter Brand. Kagiwa, 4-3, shoot. Here uh, for Inebra, time is going fast forward. They try to hold on to what could be the remaining moments of their uh, of their uh, reign as all Filipino champions. Apoleta crashes to the ground. You know, uh, as you uh, look at the Mayor Pee Trinidad on the right, and of course, uh, PBA patron Mario Raimundo on the left. Itong Hinebra. This game, Vinny Arboleda, the snatcher. If Hinebra loses this game, they will be the 22nd consecutive All Filipino champion to fail in becoming back-to-back -back All Filipino champion. Which is you know, really an astonishing stat. Only goes to show how hard it is to dominate an all Filipino conference for more than one conference uh, for more than one year. And the parity in the league, kung ganong ka dikit na ang mga from one team to the next. The last team back to back all Filipino titles was great taste back in 1985. Pero napukat They're approaching the last two minutes of the fourth quarter. Last two minutes of this knockout game. Perhaps last two minutes of the Nebra's reign as defending champions. Jack G against the basketball. It, uh, you know, that is the extra ounce of energy that Air 21 had tonight. Especially here in the fourth quarter when it seemed that Barangay Nebra, a lot of their players had uh, their hands dun sa kanilang shorts at uh, parang pagod na. Itong Air 21 eh, parang nagwa-warm up pa lang at mainit sa kanilang And we are inside the outlast uh, two minutes. I can say, you know, outlast maintenance-free batteries. Walang dagdagbawa sa tubig. Si uh, Arboleda called for just his second foul. Uh, in the game, seven points ang kailangan habulin dito ng Hinebra with less than two minutes to go. So let's see. Five-point ball game here with under two minutes to go in this knockout do-or-die ball game. So Air 21 is being loved into not running their offense. They're wasting time, but really, they're not really getting to their offense. You know, nagiging problema nila last couple of minutes. The cut on his face. Ay, you know, may uh, balino, no? We see, we see blood on his, above his lip. So, si uh, Jack Chia pinaleta na rito ni Gary David. Who joins Radedel de Ocapo, Arwin Santos, KG Candeleta, and Winnie Arboleda? Five on the shot clock. Are they aware of it? Three on the shot clock. Candeleta fires. And it's an automatic violation. You know, one and 20 in remaining, and it's just a five point ball game. And here's oh, the lead. Oh, foul. Open layup para dapat kay Eric, kay Eric Meng. Uh, okay, the issue here is the free throw shooting woes of Hinebra's big men. I talked about it at the start of the game, free throws. Hinebra will get many opportunities. They have had 12 more opportunities than Air 21, pero ano ang gagawin nila sa mga free throw na yan? So, Beck gets a split. 
And that will cut down Air 21's lead to four points a range. With one a dinner for two with the Coca-Cola Tigers in a knockout game on Sunday. Let's see if Air 21 will be able to get into their offense. Last couple of possessions, all everyone just standing around. Uh oh, get away! Blocked by Rafi Rivas. Here's Kagiwa. Tupid has the ball. Tupid all the way for two. And it's just a two point ball game. Although, I think we need to take a second look at that layup by Arwin Santos because it appeared that it hit that the board. It's oh. the backboard yung, uh, layup by Arwin Santos. And the question is if there's a chance to get the ball. Na yun. But it obviously hit the board first. Nevertheless, we're going to look at it. Two point ball game. Air 21 holding on for dear life. With one minute and six seconds to go, Gary Bebe is still at the backcourt. Got eight and seconds. It's a backcourt back court violation. Miko, how big was Jack Chia having to go out? Ibig sabihin nun, nawalan sila ng ball handler because of that injury. At nabigyan ng pagkakataon, itong barangay Hinebra, ipasok si Ronald Tubid, who played excellent defense right there and was responsible for the last layup. And so Hinebra is just down by two with one minute to go in this knockout game. For Hinebra, 12 on the shot clock. And John Wichigo just wants to make sure. With less than 50 seconds to go, Hinebra is down by just two. And here's Rivas. Big to tie. Wild off. shot. Way off. Air 21 holding on to this two-point lead. Here's Arwin Santos. Deo Campo for the tackle. Straight and through right through Hinebra's heart. You know, that is Huge TM Tres Malaki, Ranadel de Ocampo. And now Hinebra is down by five. As you look at the game reset, may think isang time what pa dalawang kapunan. Both teams are in the penalty. You know, what a swing of emotions. On one side, yung Barangay Hinebra, chance to tie. And all of a sudden, that three-point shot, it's Air 21's ball game once again. So what will Hinebra do? Helter Brand for three. Kagiwa. Salvacion for three. No. Kagiwa. No. And Hamer gets the basketball. And uh, looks like we're going to have a Sunday knockout date between A21 and Coca-Cola. Barring any miracle of biblical proportion. Well, all... Una una Miko, bago mangyari yan. If Doug Kramer misses at least one, bukas pa rin ang pintuan para dito sa Barangay Hinebra. Start of the season, na mawawala ang Barangay Hinebra at ang Token Tex. Bago tayo umabot ng quarterfinals, I would have never believed you. Not since 1985 has anyone defended the crown. It looks like uh, Hinebra will likewise fail in defending the All-Filipino Championship. And so with five seconds to go, Arwin Santos and the Air 21 Express will oust Hinebra. And actually, most of the Hinebra players are already out of the basketball court. Wow. That's not going to count, though. <laughs> but, pero, but just the same. Pasok naman yan sa, <laughs> sa ating countdown. <laughs> Ay, ang masakit dito. Mga astig, please. Hindi nakakounted. Turnover pa. <laughs> you know, that has been the conference so far para sa Barangay Hinebra. Oh. That hurts. Well, actually, Mark Kagiwa already out of the court. 